It's amazing and an incredible honor to have won the architecture category in this year's Sony World Photography Awards. To be honest, when I got the call, my main emotions were shock and surprise, but now I'm just deeply grateful. I have entered the Sony World Photography Awards for the last few years. I look at it as an opportunity to go through my whole year's worth of photography and to pick up my best series to enter. The project started when I got an invitation from an old friend to visit in the winter of 2018. Uh, I'd been out to the Canadian Prairies a number of times in the winter, but I'd never been to Lake Winnipeg, so I did a little digging uh, to find if there was anything interesting that I might like to photograph there, and when I saw pictures of the ice fishing huts, I just knew I wanted to photograph them. They're just so visually compelling that I knew they would make for an incredible series. The ice fishing huts are built mainly to protect the fishermen from the cold, obviously, but you can see from my images that many of the fishermen have decided to make a statement with the huts. Um, they can really be as individual and unique as their owners want them to be. And what's so compelling about them for me is just how quirky some of them can be. Um, obviously, many of the huts are just utilitarian, but I went and looked for the ones that were, were most interesting, odd or unusual or colorful, and those are the ones that I featured in this series. I decided to present this series as a typology. Um, the images are all shot in squares, uh, there's about the same amount of negative space around them, they're shot in the same soft light, the horizons are at the same level. And I did this intentionally because I wanted it to be able to help focus the attention on the similarities in function between the huts and the differences in form. As well, I hope that the presenting huts in this way would transform them from what they are, which is a kind of folk architecture, into pieces of art. I'd like to thank Sony and the World Photography Organization, not only for this amazing recognition, but for creating and sponsoring the Sony World Photography Awards. It's wonderful that it remains free to enter and that it's such an incredible showcase of a wide variety of photographic talent, both amateur and professional. I'd also really like to thank my own photographic community. Um, there have been so many photographers that have been a great help to me, inspiring me, encouraging me, supporting me over the years. Many of them I know in person, but most of them I actually only know online. And I'd like to thank them so much for their support. I know I would not have developed into the photographer I am today without them. And finally, I'd like to thank my parents. Um, they gave me my first camera when I was just a kid, and they always encouraged me in all my adventures, and I just wish that they were here to see this. Thank you. Thank you, everyone.